You can just have a seat right there. Sure. Uh, your ad said you needed actors to audition for a movie. Is that what you think it says? Uh, yeah. Actors needed. Uh, audition for a movie. Am I in the wrong place? No. Thank you for coming. Not many people have answered the ad. No one seems to find their way through the swamp. Interesting place you got here. What's with all these animal skins? Are you a big hunter or something? No. Great. <laughs> hey, are we filming? I like to film everything. That way I can sit back later and watch your edition to see how you look on screen. Just forget it's even there. It's just a fly on the wall. Okay, that's cool. Are you comfortable? Can I get you a glass of water or a back rub or something? What? No, thank you. I'm fine. Are you sure? If it's too hot, you can take your pants off if you like. I got a bathing suit you can wear. No, that's okay. Is this an audition for a porno? Do you want to audition for a porno? No. Then of course it's not for a porno. Don't be crazy. Okay, you had me worried there. <laughs> me to do? Why don't you tell me about yourself? Well, um, I've been acting all my life, you know, lots of uh, small theater productions and independent films, that kind of thing. Actually, I even went to acting camp in the summer when I was a little kid. Did they laugh at you? Who? The other children. Did they laugh at you because you were different? No. No one laughed at me. Did they laugh at you because you wore a beaver pelt cap to school every day? A beaver pelt I never wore a beaver. And then none of the children ever came to your birthday party, so you hid in the kitchen cupboard and played with your pet spider? Did I come at a bad time? No. <clears throat> Everything is <clears throat> fine. <clears throat> You're doing very well. Here. I'd like you to act out a scene with me from this script. My mummy never loved me? Great. <laughs> It's about a misunderstood little boy who tries desperately to gain the love of his mother despite her overwhelming addiction to alcohol and hairy, unemployed men. Let's act out the scene on page six. Okay, who am I? You're Peter, the little boy. I'll read the mother's lines. Just remember, your character is very sensitive and no one ever understands him. Okay, got it. Okay. Action! Mommy, I'm home from the liquor store. I have your Jim Beam and Southern Comfort. There you are. Did you think I wouldn't find out what you've been up to? What are you talking about? I've been ever so good lately. Please don't spank my bottom again. You're a bad little boy. You've been wearing Mommy's underpants and stockings again, haven't you? No, Mommy, I swear. Don't lie to me. They're all ruined. Those great wide hips of yours have ruined them all. I'm sorry. I couldn't help it. They're so soft on my skin. You are a mistake. No one loves you. A mistake. A mistake. Would you excuse me for a moment? I'm sorry. I just had to freshen up. No problem. Let's try something different. How about a little improv exercise to loosen things up a bit? That's a good idea, sure. What should we do? How about we're just two everyday Joes who meet on the street and we take it from there? All right. Do you want me to start? No. I'll start. Ready? Ready. Excuse me, sir. Do you have the time? It's 10.30. Why do you ask? I was just curious. Hey, you look familiar. What's your name? It's Jim. What's yours? My name's Pete. Nice to meet you, Jim. Nice to meet you. So, Jim, what do you do for a living? I'm a dance instructor. I teach ballroom dance over at the high school gym. Wow, that's interesting. Thanks. What about you, Pete? What do you do for a living? I murder people and eat their flesh. What? 
I lure people to my home, kill them, chop them up, and cook them on the barbecue. What is this? Is this a fucking joke? This isn't funny, man. Oh my god, please, put that away! What the fuck are you doing, man? Oh god, no! Oh, fuck! Wow, that was really good. Was it? Really top-notch. Very, very impressive. Great, thanks. Look, thanks very much for coming. If you could just leave your resume on the desk on your way out, I will definitely be in touch. All right, thanks again. Bye.